Okay, welcome back to the Sync Fuller Studio here in Miami, Florida. Uh, this is video three, and in this video, we're going to highlight um, the app, the Sync app. Um, so the first thing you want to do uh, when you uh, when you operate uh, the Sync app is you want to make sure you go to your settings, and you want to make sure that the Bluetooth is turned on. That's number one, step number one. Um, the next next thing you want to do is either from the Google Store or the um, Apple App Store download the sync footwear app. It's sync footwear. Just search for that and you'll be able to download the app um, The next step is to physically turn on the shoes. So there's a, a button on the inside You're gonna hold that for three seconds The LEDs are gonna appear red and that's gonna show that the shoes are on and this is a button that you can if you turn on the shoes, you just hold the button for three seconds. If you want to turn the shoes off, you hold it for three seconds. So you're going to turn on your Bluetooth. You're going to download the Sync Footwear app. You're going to um, you're going to launch the Sync Footwear app here. Let me just get here. So you're going to launch it. It's going to show our logo. You're going to enter in all your details, and then once you've done that it's going to go to a, a sync screen or a screen that'll let you physically sync the shoes. So here we go. This is the screen here where it's going to search for the circuit board within the shoe. Um, and each shoe has its own unique circuit board. Once it finds uh, the circuit board, it will um, give you a code and it'll say it's connected. And for example, if we were to connect to a second shoe, we would just press this button. It's going to search for the shoe. The shoe. But for this example, we're just. I'm just going to uh, show you with just with one shoe. So let's go. Is what you press. This is the solid color um, mode or function. Let's see if I can get this. Okay. So I've designed this to look like a turntable. And as you can see here, you're in the solid color mode. This is basically the control panel of the app. You can choose whatever color you want. The next area of the app is gonna be presets. So you're just gonna hit the preset button. This screen will come up and here you can choose various presets. You can actually choose the um, speed of the presets. Um, again, I'll go through this really quickly just so you can see a couple of different options. So these are the, these are the presets and there's several presets in here. What you wanna do if you wanna close out of the presets is in this center column here right above it there's a little tab and let me show you that again in the center column here there's a little tab and that'll actually close you out of the presets what i usually like to do is go back to solid color so you're back in the solid color mode and then you go from the from the solid color mode it gives you access to all the other different um, functions of the app so the next feature is the music mode and in this mode, what you're going to do is install music here into your um, into this area of the app. Um, once you do that, you basically you basically let me go back here. Music. You basically are gonna choose whichever songs you want to select. So you know whatever music you have in there, and you can scroll through this. You know again, there's a forward and a back, and the lights will follow whatever music is in your. I'm sure you've seen this on some of my videos. So this will just scroll right through. The next feature or function is going to be the live mode, what we've designated as mic check mode, but it's really the live mode. Um, again, you wanna, you, you see here in the music mode, the, the button is highlighted. You wanna press that button again. You kinda wanna go back to the solid color mode just so it resets everything. And then you're just gonna press on the mic mode. And then when you press on the mic mode, this is gonna pick up outside music. So as I'm talking here, you can see the lights are flashing and this will follow whatever music is in the background. Um, this is really the key feature to the Sync Footwear app. So I've, I've highlighted the solid color mode, the preset mode, um, the live mode or mic check mode. Um, let me just show you just a few other things on the app. To access the Sync section of the app, you're gonna scroll um, to the to the right and to access the settings you're gonna scroll to the left and in here you can add your picture um, there is a settings feature with language um, let's say you you've purchased more than one pair of the sync footwear shoes 
in order to disconnect completely from uh, the shoes, you want to unbind the shoes. So if you see here in this area, it'll say unbind. You just click this button, it'll ask you, and you just click sure. And that'll release the shoe from the app um, or the shoes from the app. And you just want to kind of scroll back. And then what it'll do is it'll ask you again to sync to the shoe. Now we're going to resync. Here's the code. I'm going to click on it. The code will show up here. Let's go. And then we're back uh, to the solid color mode. So these are the basic functions. If you have any additional questions, you know, send me an email at info at syncfootwear.com. Um, I will shoot some additional videos to highlight some of the key features of, of, different, of the different videos we've already shot. But again, um, this is a sync app. Remember, number one most important thing is turn the Bluetooth on your phone. If you don't do that, it won't find the shoes. I appreciate your business and sync your soul.